Here's my new favorite tool, the Milwaukee M18 inflator. We've uh, got it been sitting here overnight, three bars on the battery. Um, it's about 20 degrees outside here in Hanky Mountain. And I've got a low, low tire here on this Toyota Camry. So this thing, it'll max out at about 150 PSI. And I believe the warranty is five years. This inflator is awesome. It will, it's got a tire gauge built in. So it's showing 30 PSI. We'll take it up to, I believe this tires, it'll go up to 44. So we'll take it up to 40. We've got some really cold weather coming. So I'll inflate it pretty good. Now we're going to do a test here. I've got the stopwatch. We're going from 30 to 40. We're going to see how long this takes. All right. This thing is lightning fast. So I have one of these Bostic compressors that is just a big pain in the butt that I normally have to use. And you have to wait for the compressor to get to 40 or 50 PSI overall before you can do anything with it. Whereas this little compressor, you just stick it on there and you're ready to roll. Shout out to the Den of Tools for most all my tool purchases. Uh, we, we've almost got it here. Let's see, we're sitting at about... Alright, so it has stopped. You can hear it's got a fan, 40 seconds. It's got a fan in the compressor itself that kicks on to keep it nice and cool. So, it automatically shuts off. And it also has a feature here that it has memory. So you can... I have a second memory set for 65 psi for my truck i haven't set up the other ones but you can set it to quick sets so you don't have to dial it up here on these on these plus and minus um increase and decrease buttons it also has a manual mode you can just run it if you're you know inflating a ball or something we're going to go to this other tie here the another really really nice feature that this has the, the cord is nice and long it has a screw on brass cap so you can screw it on and you do not have to worry about it coming off so we'll take these oh yeah we're only 28.5 so we'll take her up to 40 here again this tool is just it does not take a lot of battery to run either it does not use that battery up that's just a standard m18 5.0 but this this tool is my new favorite tool that I have, period. Uh, Cobalt makes a really nice one for a lot less money. It doesn't quite have all the features, and it's a little bit cheaper cheaper made. It's also slower, but if you have the Cobalt system, I'll put a link for that. It's a great alternative. And Milwaukee almost also makes a 12-volt version of this. It doesn't run on the big battery. It runs on the small battery that also is fantastic it's just a little bit slower and the the psi max psi rating is not as high as this 18 volt so we're done again pretty sweet have a great day ain't perfect but it's better than it was